Bible word of the day. Bible vocabulary. Censor. Used in priestly duties. Let's discuss about censor. Censors were used by the priests as part of the prescribed ceremonies and worship of God. Censors were usually small metal containers kept on the end of a chain. The censors themselves were usually made of bronze or gold. The chain would be used to carry the censer because the censer itself was used to carry hot live coals to light fires for the tabernacle, and later the temple. When combined with a powdered incense they would be used for worship. The priest was given specific instructions by God on when and how to use the censers for worship. Therefore, for the most part they were used for holy activities. However, sometimes those in rebellion against God would use them in an unholy manner. Examples of this include Nadab and Abihu, as well as Korah and his followers. In both these circumstances these men tried to usurp the roles, authority and duties of the priest in direct defiance against God. Censors were also used on the Day of Atonement, which was the one day during the year when the high priest would correctly use censors as part of the sacrifice for himself and the people. The Day of Atonement was necessary for the people, including the priesthood. This ceremony would allow God to cover the sins of the people for the upcoming year. And Aaron shall bring the bull of the sin offering, which is for himself, and make atonement for himself and for his house, and shall kill the bull as the sin offering which is for himself. Then he shall take a censer full of burning coals of fire from the altar before the Lord, with his hands full of sweet incense beaten fine, and bring it inside the veil. And he shall put the incense on the fire before the Lord that the cloud of incense may cover the mercy seat that is on the testimony, lest he die. Leviticus 16 verses 11-13 Then Nadab and Abihu, the sons of Aaron, each took his censer and put fire in it, put incense on it, and offered profane fire before the Lord, which he had not commanded them. So, fire went out from the Lord and devoured them, and they died before the Lord. And Moses said to Aaron, This is what the Lord spoke, saying, by those who come near me I must be regarded as holy, and before all the people I must be glorified. So, Aaron held his peace. And Moses called Mishael and Elzaphan, the sons of Uzziel the uncle of Aaron, and said to them, Come near, carry your brethren from before the sanctuary out of the camp. Leviticus 10 verses 1-4 and Moses said to Korah, Tomorrow, you and all your company be present before the Lord you and they, as well as Aaron. Let each take his censer and put incense in it, and each of you bring his censer before the Lord, two hundred and fifty censers, both you and Aaron, each with his censer. So, every man took his censer, put fire in it, laid incense on it, and stood at the door of the tabernacle of meeting with Moses and Aaron. Numbers 16 16-18 